Hi guys, welcome to my channel. This is a sudden vlog po. I'm making this video out of a friend's question who's asking kung ano ang difference ng CC cream and barely there. Actually, they're not new products of Beauty Derm, pero meron pa rin mga new users of Beauty Derm. Hindi pa sila fully aware sa mga makeup items na meron ang Beauty Derm. So, I'm going to present to you yung difference ng products na to. I'm going to like share kung anong shade meron sila, yung price, yung size, and yung finish kapag na-apply sila sa ating skin. Though I'm not going to use them in this video, I can put the link of my previous video where I use this product sa description netong video na to. You can always go and check that out. Okay, let's go straight forward sa CC cream po muna because ito yung tinatanong. So guys, this is CC cream. As you can see, it does come in two shades. One is beige and one is light beige. This is considered like a makeup and skincare in one. Kasi meron po siyang my skin vitamins and also it comes with SPF 60. So just in case in the morning, nakapar, get toner ka na and then hydrated naman yung skin mo, nag-apply ka ng... Um, say visage phrase to keep your skin hydrated and then nag foundation ka kaagad kapag nakalimutan mong mag sunblock it's okay kasi meron naman po itong SPF 60 so that is CC cream po and also yung size wala po kayong ibang pagpipilian this is 60 ml and it comes in one size only Meron po itong um, cushion version, pero kung gusto niyo yung naka-tube, isang size lang po siya, 60 ml, but in two shades, light beige or beige. Now, let's go to Barely There. So, this is Barely There. The one that I'm holding is in 30 ml, but it actually come in three sizes. So, ito yung pinakamaliit. That's 5 grams. This is 30 ml. And yung pinakamalaki nito, which I don't have at the moment, is 60 ml. So just imagine this is 60 ml. So ganito rin po kalaki yung biggest size ng barely there. In terms of shade naman po, you don't have any choice. Kasi barely there come in one shade only. Which I'm going to show you later on kapag i-apply ko na lang po sila dito sa aking arms. So you can have a closer look kung ano yung difference sila in terms of shade. So this is also considered, kung ito po is like a skincare and a makeup in one, this is a 3-in-1 foundation. Because it is a primer, a concealer, and a foundation in one. So, I have friends who would like to use primer first before they would put their foundation. They can use Barely There as their primer and use CC Cream as their foundation. That's totally fine. But my personal preference, kapag ako po, hindi ko na sila pinagahalo. Kapag in the morning, CC Cream ang ginamit ko, CC Cream na lang talaga. Kapag Barely There naman ang kinuha ko, Barely There lang talaga. Yun lang, hindi ko na sila mini-mix pa. Now, in terms of yung finish, ano ang itsura niya kapag na-apply sa skin mo? So, minsan dito mo nagbe-base yung ibang tao kapag bumibili sila ng foundation nila. Itong CC cream, it would give you a dewy look. Medyo uh, mas makintab po siya sa mukha. But if your preference is matte, Oh, pwede mo naman gamitin, uh, pero gusto mo CC cream, pwede mong gamitin si CC cream and then just apply loose powder, loose powder on top of your CC cream. Meron din po tayong Bell Mineral Powder. So, pwede nyo rin pong gawin yon. Ito naman pong si Barely There, pag in sa skin, in nyo sa mukha ninyo, matte ang finish niya. So, this is perfect sa mga gusto ng matte finish. And, Ang napansin ko, kasi parehas ko silang ginagamit, mas matipid itong si Barely There. That's probably why meron din siyang maliliit na size. Kasi ako, like ako, ito ang ginagamit ko. So kapag nag-open ako ng ganito, nag-re-refill lang din ako sa maliit ng container para maliit lang yung nasa um, mirror ko. Etong ganito kaliit, sobrang tagal kong maubos nito kasi you only need a little bit of this and ang layo na ng mako-cover niya sa mukha mo. Full coverage na talaga kahit konti lang yung gagamitin mo. 
mas marami akong nagagamit dito kesa dito. And after a long day, mas makapit si Barely There kesa sa CC Cream. Mas nagtatagal ito sa mukha. So, kung siguro yung occasion na pupuntahan mo is ilang hours ka dun and gusto mong nakikita pa rin yung foundation mo or mukhang parang kaka-apply lang, you go for Barely There. And ito naman, okay lang din naman to for daily use. Okay lang din siyang gamitin kahit sa mga special occasions. On my... Um, previous video, nung ginamit ko silang pareho, I have a viewer na nanood, syempre viewer siya no? <laughs> nanood sa video, nag-comment sabi niya, the beige look good daw sa skin ko and ang sabi niya gamitin ko daw siya during the day and kapag meron naman daw akong night outs or party na pupuntahan kapag gabi, gamitin ko daw yung light beige. Kasi when I use them Parang tingin ko lang, parang okay naman sila parehas sa akin. Wala akong sasabihin na ay mas okay yung beige sa akin or mas okay yung light beige. Now, let's go sa ano? Sa price. Mas mahal po si Barely There kesa ito, si si Queen. Why did I say that? Yung size ng 30ml na ito is same sa price ng 60ml na ito. Kaya ko nasabing mas mahal itong Barely There. Because this is 30ml. Kasi yung price siya ng 60ml ng CC Cream. Now, let's go sa shades na nila. Gusto kong ipakita closely kung ano yung pagkakaiba ng mga shade nila. Now, let's get a bit of the light beige. Ito po yung light beige. Kukuha na lang ako sa side. So, yan si light beige. And, apply natin dito. Yan. So, this is light beige. Parang nakaubusan ako ng boses. <laughs> Naglilikot kasi kanina yung baby ko. Now, let's go beige. Kukuha din ako dito sa side niya. Ito yung beige. Lalagay ko just under it. Ayan, nakikita ba yung difference? I think I need more. Ayan. May konti lang yung difference, right? Ang, ang ano lang dito sa CC Cream... One thing that I would like to mention about CC Cream, nag-oxidize ito. So, in case nag-apply kayo ng light base, light beige sa skin ninyo, and you think parang masyadong maputi, kapag humalo yun sa pawis ninyo, after a few minutes, after a few hours, nagiging darker siya a bit. Hindi siya siguro masyadong napapansin, pero for someone who is so keen sa mga ganito, makikita yung difference na medyo naging darker siya. Hindi naman super super dark no but you can you can see. Ito try natin si Barely There. So this is Barely There. Oops. Yan, si Barely There. Lagay natin dito sa ilalim ni beige. There you go. So yan yung difference nila. That's light beige, beige and Barely There. Now, ang ginagawa ko personally Kasi ginagamit ko nga sila parehas. What I do in the morning, kasi parehas ko silang gusto, I get a bit of the beige one, and I mix it with the light beige. So, I'm going to show you as well kung ano ang itsura niya kapag nag-mix sila together. So, ito. Ito yung light beige. So, this is beige and light beige combined. Beige and light beige combined would give you this shade. Yan. I hope nakikita niyo yung difference, no? Hindi siya masyadong um, malayo. But I hope may makikita kayong difference niya. So, this is it for my video for today. I hope you've learned something. If you have a friend who need this video, feel free to share. So, gusto niyong balikan yung past video ko? I'm going to put the link on the description below. Thanks everyone for watching. Have a nice day. Bye!